Hello, friends. Dr. Nancy Trimbley here, putting the power and knowledge of your health back in your hands. Today, we're talking about at-home red light therapy devices. You know, I have been saying for years, every home should have a cold laser. Well, cold laser is now uh, under the umbrella of red light therapy. And more and more and more people are getting turned on to red light therapy, whether it's for rosacea and acne or wrinkles or weight, um, I shouldn't say weight loss, but fat loss um, for toning, for uh, re regenerative uh, capabilities, for performance. Uh, so now my uh, TerraQuant cold laser that I've been using on, I use in my course and I've been using on videos for years, I love this. I know how to use this. I know the capabilities of it. I know that it can work for anything surface like pain, like inflammation. Um, you know, my tuning fork facial, I also say that you can do a facial for yourself using the cold laser because of lymphatic drainage. I have recommended this and actually have in my course how it can help with um, healing bones and recovering from injury in half the time, recovering from a surgery in half the time. So I love the TerraQuant Solo Cold Laser. It is completely wireless. Uh, you uh, charge it. The charge lasts for eight hours. And when you're only using this for a few minutes a day, eight hours lasts a long time. It has the ability to have an attachment on here. It has, uh, has multiple attachments. This one is for using it on trigger points. And there's also an attachment to use it for acupuncture points. I love, love, love this, except for the fact that it's $3,000. Love it, $3,000. That is a big chunk of change for a lot of people. Just as a little side story, I dropped one off to my mom um, it's got to be two years ago now. She's in her upper 80s. She's got some different things going on. She's very, very active, but I can't get it back from her. I, ha I, this, I had to buy another one so that she can keep my, my TerraQuant Solo Laser. She uses it all the time for multiple different things. So anyway, easy to use and good for all ages. So I have you know, for years, people are asking me, Dr. Nancy, isn't there a less, less, um, less expensive item that would do the same thing? So finally, things are becoming more available at a lower cost. And I did some research and I bought a few of these things. So I'm going to go over these different, um, these different uh, devices, good, bad, um, which ones I would recommend, which ones I would not. Before I get into that, we need to talk about um, red light and near infrared and far infrared frequencies. Um, and I'm going to screen share and show you. So I'm showing you, this is an article um, that I stumbled across that I just um, love. It, I would highly recommend you um, read this article fully. It's not that long. It explains red light therapy very, very nicely. And what I love about it right here at the beginning of the article, they have this huge chart with different um, nanometers, different frequencies, different wavelengths, actually, the nanometers and what they are good for. For instance, we have... Um, we have weight loss, fat burning, cellulite reduction, metabolism, thyroid, anti-aging, acne, scars, rosacea, hair growth, sun damage, wrinkles, droopy eyes, uh, under eye circles, broken capillaries, pain relief, wound healing, injury healing, muscle building, athletic performance. I'm not gonna continue to read the list because you can read it yourself. This is a phenomenal article. And then based on the research, it says what wavelengths of red light are good for what things? Super cool. All right, so let's get into it. I'm gonna start with another handheld device. And this one, um, it kind of resembled the TerraQuant and how you hold it. So that's why I went with it. It was also $99. So I thought that's super affordable, especially when you can uh, avoid medication, avoid 
uh, going back to your MD for the same complaint over and over again. You can avoid other expensive medical interventions like, um, you know, uh, or even uh, med spa interventions by doing some things at home. Oh, disclaimer, right off the bat here. If you are in a crisis right now, immediately go to your uh, qualified healthcare professional. Red light therapy is not for a crisis situation. That's number one. Number two, I am not a physicist. Um, I, um, and I, I, I can't even call myself an expert in red light therapy. I have just been utilizing it for years and years and years on myself, for my family, in my practice. And, um, and I, what my goal right today is to simplify things and to explain to you how I understand it. Now, some things I might not quite understand, so then my explanation might not be quite on target. So please give me grace for that. So this one right here, let me see if it's charged. It might, oh, here we go. This one, there we go. It, uh, it has an on switch. It has a timer. It automatically starts at five minutes. That is the same as a Terraquan Soul. It starts at five minutes. And it also has a power. Now the power goes um, one little blue line, two little blue lines, three little blue lines, four little blue lines. If we go to the, uh, the little booklet that comes with it, um, this is what it says about those different um, power levels. Let's see. The power level just indicates if it's working at 10%, 20%, or something like that. Let's see. I'm not, this is how big it is. So this is about how much explanation you get. So it's not a lot. Um, yes, power display. There are two wavelengths in these diodes, these layer diodes, 650 and 808. So I'm going to try to hold up my camera. I know I don't know if you can see it. So it's 650 and 808. I'm going to screen share again so we can go back to this chart. And so we have 650 and 808. So 650 is right here. Now you see that, okay, here it is. It's good for anti-aging, like skin conditions, going down to pain relief, depression, anxiety. I'm not familiar with that research. Fertility and sperm mobility, not familiar. So that's 650. So it's good for pain relief and skin things. But here's the little, mm, uh, not so sure about this. It says that it is um, plus or minus 20 nanometers. All right, so that means it, you could be, it's not calibrated. You could be getting anywhere from 640 all the way up to, or actually 630, all the way up to 670. So it might not actually be doing what you want it to do because if it's running at say 633, it's not going to help with pain relief. For the 808 nanometer, well, that's not even on here. So I don't, I'm not even sure if there's any research that supports 808 nanometers, but that one is plus or minus 20 nanometers as well. So if you're lucky enough that it really is firing at 810 nanometers, maybe it would help with weight loss. Maybe it would help with pain relief, but I don't see anything on this chart to indicate what 808 nanometers does. Now, it doesn't mean it's not out there. It just means, you know, from my, my research, I can't find anything. I will tell you, I did try this one. I used it for five minutes. My shoulder had been bothering me. You guys probably know I have an old injury to my right shoulder. My shoulder had been bothering me. So I just sat for five minutes, held it on there. Now, here's one thing. There's no beep when it's done. So I was thinking to myself, oh, Five minutes sounds like it could be up and it was off. That's a little thing. Well, guess what? My shoulder felt 75% better. So that was good. I also, around the same time, my sinuses were bothering me from an allergy. I used it on my sinuses like I normally would do. I would, I would hold it. I would pull the sinus congestion towards my lymph nodes, pull the edema towards my lymph nodes. I also felt better with that for $99. That's pretty good. 
One thing did happen as I was using it. Um, there's no beep. So you press and hold the power button. And because of the design and because I was not able to look at it when I was working on my face, I would inadvertently be pressing the power button and turning it and it was off. So even with that, I, I did feel better. So my big issue with this is it is not calibrated. You don't know exactly what you're getting. And it could be that it is calibrated perfectly to the pain relief setting or the surface skin relief setting when I took it out of the box. And after I use it 10 times, maybe it gets uncalibrated. I don't know. I honestly don't know. But this one's $99. Here's the box that it came in. Oh, and this one you can have completely wireless. It is chargeable. Here's the box it came in. There is not one indicator on here of the manufacturer, where it came from. It is made in China. There is a number on here. Other than that, there's nothing on the little booklet that says who makes this. No idea. I'll talk about this next one now. This next one is in this box here because I'm sending it back. Um, I bought two right away. I had the Terraquant. I had another one. Actually, I had another two I'll talk about in a moment. But this one was $169. I thought, let me try it. Maybe it's calibrated. Maybe uh, it's more specific on the nanometers, like it's not plus or minus 20 nanometers. This one's exactly the same as the $99 one. Oh, not exactly. I'm sorry. It's a different color. It's exactly the same, $169. So buyer beware, if it looks like it's exactly the same online, it probably is. All right, onward. The next one I'll show you is a wrap, which this reminded me of our um, contour light, red light blankets at the office, which um, what those do, and I'm sorry, I don't have, I, I probably, I mean, I know that, um, I know that nanometer, but I just can't recall it right now. So I, I didn't research if it's the same nanometer. Um, but this one, uh, as far as the booklet goes, and see, this is what it looks like. It has Velcro straps on it. This is about, oh, maybe an eighth of the size of one of our large red light blankets we have at the office for our contour light. Our contour light is our... Um, uh, toning and uh, fat loss um, laser blankets, uh, laser pro uh, red light program. Uh, if you want to know more that, about that, go to our website, tremblycairo.net. So this one uh, fires at two different wavelengths as well. Let me screen share and we'll look at that again. It fires at 660. Okay, look at that, 660 right there. Look at the, all that beautiful stuff it does. I mean, everything from weight loss, fat burning to skin conditions to pain relief, wound healing, muscle repair, post-workout post, uh, recovery, um, all the stuff, uh, stem cell regeneration, hypertension, um, and viral, viral issues. So that's 660. It doesn't say anything about plus or minus 20 on here, but again, um, I'm just curious as to how they prove that it's firing at that um, nanometer. And also we have 850 on here, which is here, which does all kinds of beautiful stuff as well. This one, um, I think it, definitely worked a bit for some inflammation that I was having. The only thing about it, I'm not going to turn it on because I don't, I'm not sure. So I don't want to blind myself. The only thing about it is that if you want to use it for like neck pain or muscle spasm, I don't know how you would get it to wrap around you. I use it for some inflammation that I was having here uh, in, in the lymph nodes of my armpits. Uh, if you want to know more about that, look at our um, thermography video. Um, so I did think it helped a little bit with that. Lymphatic drainage massage helped a lot more. 
Could it help with fat loss? Not so sure. Again, this one, um, it was, um, can't remember exactly. It was about a hundred dollars. If you wanted to give it a try, I don't think it would hurt you, but the usability of it is limited just because it's a wrap. You can basically use it around your middle. Maybe you can wrap it around a leg, but probably not even, probably not even an ankle just because of it's very, it's stiff. And while I'm talking about that, I wanted to talk about, um, let's see. Oh, a couple of things. With both uh, this handheld, this $99 handheld and the wrap, it is not, it is not super pulsed. The wrap has a pulse to it. With the handheld, when you have the setting up to the four bars, that is um, pulsed. The same thing goes for the wrap. Um, it is pulsed if I turn it on and I change the setting, you should be able to see. There you go. So that is pulsed. And the reason the, they say the reason why they do the pulsed is for heat. So that people that are sensitive to heat can tolerate it better. What this tells me is that this is not a class one laser or red light. Um, when a red light builds up heat, it is more dangerous. Um, and so it tells me it's not, it is a class two, three, or four. The Turquant Solo is a class one. It does not create heat. These other red light um, devices do. And so they have this pulse movement. Um, a class one is always the best laser. So again, we're trying to avoid spending $3,000. So, but just keep this in the back of your mind. By the way, I'm going to screen share again with our chart because I want to show you uh, who sponsored this awesome article which like I said, definitely read it. It is very good. Now this is the ad for what's sponsoring, who's sponsoring this article, maybe who wrote it, I don't know. But you see how, if you look at the screen, you can see how these are red lights in a stand and it's got this lovely woman meditating uh, and it, it includes a free stand or a hanging kit and eye protection. I did not even order this one. The reason why I didn't order it is because the red light has to be as close to your skin as possible. There are some instances where I have used the Terraquant Solo and because I had I was so inflamed or injured, I was unable to make skin contact or even have the red light close to me. It was, my skin was very sensitive and that's the only exception but the red light needs to be as close to your skin as possible. So when you have something that's in a stand that's inches away from you, I don't care if it's two inches, it is not going to be as effective or as effective, nowhere close to effective. So don't waste your money on anything that's not skin contact. And even um, it will have decreased ability to get through um, clothing. This, the Terraquan Solo, we can use this through hair, metal, clothing. Um, this is different. Remember, this is the more expensive one. With, with all these other red light devices, it needs to be skin contact. All right, so we talked about the Super Pulse. Let me share again with you, but share this website. This is the Multi Radiance website. That is the Terraquan Solo maker. And it talks about super pulsing. So these other cheap ones I have are pulsing to not generate as much heat. Here we have super pulsing, which is completely different. The super pulsing actually prevents your body from adapting to the, the red light. Adapting meaning it's ineffective when your body adapts to it. 
um, so it prevents your body from adapting. Um, and also it, it increases the depth of penetration into the deeper tissues of the body. Like for instance, when we're talking about healing a broken bone, that's not surface like your skin. When, um, like when we're healing skin, whether it's a bruise or a laceration or a burn or an insect bite or a bee sting, or working on lymph drainage, that's very surface. It's, it's less than a millimeter or maybe a millimeter or two, but that's it. But when we're healing bone, we have to be going deeper probably three, four, two, three, four inches, depending on the bone. Well, this, the super post of the TerraQuant solo device, the expensive one, um, allows us, uh, uh, allows that because of the super pulsing. So don't be tricked by super pulsing versus pulsed. Two completely different concepts. All right. Oh, you know what? The, um, the other thing I wanted to show you on this same this same website is the, um, the different nanometers that are in the Ter Terraquan Solo. And this is a very cool website. We'll include the link uh, in the uh, show description. Um, and uh, so it has 905 super pulsed and uh, it has 875. It has 660, I think 660 is like the sweet spot and 460. And remember that the Terraquan Solo is calibrated. It is frequently calibrated. Next, um, we're gonna, I'm gonna see if we can drop, um, drop in a photo of this one. Now, this is my healthy line, um, my healthy line um, uh, grounding mat. Um, this is, um, let's see. This is to, uh, it's PEMF. PEMF um, is analogous to the Earth's magnetic field, which we are um, cut off from in our society because we don't, uh, we wear shoes with rubber soles. So we're not getting that, uh, that frequency from the Earth. We live over basements. So again, we're not getting that frequency from the Earth. That's another story for another day. This um, healthy line PEMF mat happens to have 660 photon lights in it. And remember, that seems to be the sweet spot. Let me double check. Let me share and look at our um, look at our chart here. Yeah, 660 is the one that covers a lot of bases in all these different categories. Um, and it specifically says that you should have skin to skin contact in order to get the benefit of the PEMF or, or the benefit of the 660 nanometer red light therapy. Otherwise, every other layer of this mat works with through clothing. Oh, <laughs> something we, um, I had, um, I had learned early on when I was teaching about red light therapy and cold laser therapy was that you should never look at the red light and also do not use it over the thyroid. Well, actually all uh, those are now considered misconceptions. And actually, if you look at uh, the red light of 660 nanometers, um, it can benefit your eyes. Now, this is a study that was just done on mice, but I tried it myself. Uh, I am not, I don't have the, I don't have the red, red light like this. Um, I actually look at the mat that I have, this PEMF mat that I have in a chair in my home. I'm about three feet from it. I do find the days that I do that, it could be my imagination, but I feel like my vision is more crisp. Another use for red light therapy um, is using earbuds, earbuds with a red light in them. Um, I stumbled upon this. I thought it might help with some ear ringing. I haven't tested it yet. Um, these, this was only $20 and, the uh, let's see, it is at a 650 nanometer. And I don't honestly think that ear ringing is on our chart. Let's see. Tinnitus. There it is. There it is. Tinnitus is another word for ringing the ears. There it is. 650. All right. Um, so that is the nanometer wavelength for ear ringing. 
when um, one of my podcast guests was unable to uh, keep her interview appointment with me because she had a ruptured eardrum. Weird, right? Um, so I said, mm, I don't know if it'll help, but red light, red light is healing to the tissues and that's a very thin tissue. I said, why don't you try these earbuds? They're $20. What could you lose? Um, and she said it did help. It did help it feel better, decrease the pain. She thinks maybe it healed faster. So there you go. That's there. Uh, you can get that from your favorite online retailer. Um, let's see. So my guess uh, to wrap this up and my hope for you is that you learn to discern what might be a good red light therapy device for you, your family, your kids, your pets. Um, I hope that this helped. You need to look at the wavelength, uh, the nanometers that the uh, device uh, provides. Um, it's best if it could be calibrated, but honestly, I don't think any of these cheap devices are calibrated. Don't spend more than you should. Look at all the devices, make sure there's skin contact, um, make sure that it's something that is usable on the body part you think you might need it, um, and give it a try. It's worth spending $100 if you can uh, save time going out for um, a therapy or reaching for a medication, especially. So hope that helps. Bye for now.